Main article. Ram Kota's lightsaber after his resurrection on board the Empirical. Marek was given the weapon of Ram Kota, which he had originally retrieved for Vader during his duel with the Jedi Master. Marek quickly adjusted to the green-bladed weapon, utilizing it during his escape from the Empirical. The weapon saw use on Cloud City and Kashyyyk against the likes of the Imperial Shadow Guard and Captain Ozzik Stern. However, while Marek wielded the weapon successfully in combat, he never truly felt that it was his own, and was unsuccessful at utilizing it in his meditations. To rectify this, he replaced the green lightsaber crystal utilized by Kota with a blue crystal he found on Kashyyyk in the ruins of his family's hut, the crystal from his father's lightsaber. After an hour of fine-tuning to fit in the new crystal, the weapon was finished. The newly modified weapon made Marek feel as though it was truly his lightsaber from that moment on. With the new aqua-colored crystal, the blade seemed lighter and moved more readily in Marek's hands. He also noted the weapon's superior optical properties. After its modification, Marek continued to use the weapon, ultimately using it against the very man who gave it to him, Darth Vader. After defeating Vader, Marek wielded the weapon against his former master's master, Palpatine. Marek managed to subdue Palpatine, but ultimately was incapacitated by the Emperor's Force Lightning, which Marek blocked to save his friends from Palpatine's wrath, at the cost of his own life. The weapon remained with Marek until his death and was found beside him by Vader and Palpatine. As the Emperor turned to leave, Vader crushed the lightsaber to dust beneath his boot heel.